Introducing tonight. Live from Studio A. It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. A beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? It's a neighborly day in this beauty wood. A neighborly day for a beauty. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? I've always wanted to have a neighbor just like you. I've always wanted to live in a neighborhood with you. So let's make the most of this beautiful day. Since we're together, we might as well say, would you be mine? Could you be mine? Won't you be my neighbor? Won't you please? Won't you please? Please won't you be my neighbor? Well, you've tuned in again, and whether or not that's a good thing or a bad thing, it's, not good. it's me, Eddie, and this is Braden over here on the piano today, and it's Musical Monday time right here at almost 4 o'clock live, and we're glad to be uh, able to come to you today and help you through, hopefully, what has a, been a good Monday for you, and uh, of course, our theme around here today, as you can tell, is a whole lot of love uh, going on. And uh, we want to thank Teresa Schmoltzke for the lovely decorations. So, Braden, how are you doing today? I'm good, and we totally didn't decorate this in, <laughs> in a hectic 60 seconds before we went live. <laughs> this looks like a yeah. man decorated this in, yeah, pretty much. in can, one minute. You can see the scotch tape on the wall back there, and uh, that's, that's a big budget uh, here in Studio A. Yep. We're here with this, uh, Josh cloth? Steeman, our producer. Yeah, that's a tablecloth. Don't, don't mess with it too okay. much or it's right. going to fall. <laughs> All right. We, we thought it would be appropriate. We thought it would be appropriate if Eddie just recited some words of love to Mary <laughs> as I play just a gentle background, maybe a, uh, maybe a love poem. All right. All right, we got it? We good? Sounds the same to me, but uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway, uh, I was waiting on it to change, and then strings. I was like, oh, nice. I'll, I'll have to listen to that at home later tonight when I can hear uh, what it was. So, as they say, roses are red, violets are blue, sugar is sweet, and so are you. Happy Valentine's Day. So I'm just going to ask a question that here. That was too fast. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to ask a question today. Uh, how many of you men have uh, plans for your fortunate Valentine tomorrow? Because it's coming up uh, really soon. And I hope that you've uh, planned a little bit better than Braden here. But uh... You know how many <laughs> midnight runs to Walmart I've made over the years? <laughs> if you want to buy roses, they're going to be $90 that's, now. That's right. And uh, I think my Walmart, Walgreens stock is up. So uh, that's good. So keep stopping by <laughs> on the 14th. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. Remember when roses used to be like $12? I don't yeah, know what happened. I know. I know. There's but always the carnation backup, though, just in case. you know. I asked my wife on Saturday, do you want a card or do you want $6? And she said $6. And that's how we <laughs> rolled our house. So. Well, you know, $6 in the hand is worth, what, uh, 12 in the bush or something I don't like know. that? She, she just didn't want me to spend our money. She's in charge of the money our house. So. Well, you know, sometimes you can dig up a, like an old card and repurpose it a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Well, the kids make one with crowns and stuff. Yeah. Mary Mary said, yeah, to her um, to your love poem. Oh, thank you, Mary. See, uh, I'm fortunate to have a wife who... Uh, Loves deeply, but doesn't need some of these uh, little extra things a lot. Uh, sometimes I surprise them, her with them, but uh, sometimes she just says, I just want us to be together, and that's a pretty cool quality, thing. Is so, quality time her love language? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's good. So that's a pretty cool thing that uh, we get to do and try to make time uh, for that special someone in your life, uh, whether it's tomorrow or whether you're uh, going to do that today. Uh, because uh, we don't know sometimes what tomorrow brings, but we know that uh, he puts us together. 
uh, for a purpose and a reason. And uh, it's always good to express love to your children, to your spouse, uh, to that special someone in your life that uh, maybe just needs a word of encouragement or a word of hope. And, and that's kind of what we want to do here uh, today in singing some of the songs. Uh, uh, but help us out a little bit. Uh, give us some suggestions and... Uh, mm-hmm. We uh, will try to get those uh, sung for you today to the best of our ability. And uh, This sounds like a, like a telemarketing fundraiser I know. right now. Uh, and if you'd like to give donations to the Help Braden Out on Valentine's Day Fund <laughs> <laughs> so that he doesn't have to stop by Walgreens uh, on his way home. Let uh, me tell you, I'm not alone. There's about 150 <laughs> other men there every time I go. It ain't just me. I know. Might be a Cane Bay thing or something like that, huh? <laughs> All right, so we're going to do some love songs. Will you come sit over here so you can see the book? Oh, uh, okay. Ready? i got to see the book. And we'll take your request. And I hope you say something weird so we can watch him sweat. <laughs> what was it? I lost the page. What was it? Uh, where those tags are, those yellow ones, the yellow okay. ones. All right. All right. We got an Oklahoma song. Woo! Oklahoma the musical. It's not just about Oklahoma. If we miss a few words, that's only because I can't read them from this distance, but that's okay. (laughs) All right, this is from the musical Oklahoma. People will say we're in love. Not us. (laughs) That's just the name of the song. That's correct. (laughs) (laughs) Don't throw bouquets at me. Don't please my folks too much don't laugh at my jokes too much people will say we're in love don't sigh and gaze at me your sides are so like mine Your eyes mustn't glow like mine. People will say we're in love. Don't start collecting things. Give me my rose and my glove. Sweetheart, they're suspect. Not too bad for Oklahoma, right? We never played that ever together. <laughs> ever. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's how you how we roll on Musical Monday, I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to play some more musicals until we see some requests come up. Yeah, y'all better help us out here yeah. soon. Soon. Some enchanted evening, you may see a stranger. You may see a stranger across a crowded room And somehow you know, you know even then That somewhere you'll see her again and again Some enchanted evening Someone may be laughing, you may hear her laughing across a crowded room. <laughs> and night after night, be serious, it's a love song. As strange as it seems, the sound of her laughter will sing in your oh, dreams. There it is, sorry. Who can explain it? How can, t- who can tell you why? Sorry. Stay Fool, seated, folks. Fools give you no reasons. Wise men ever, ever try. Woo! Some enchanted evening When you find your true love When you feel her call you Across a crowded room, then fly to her side. 
and make her your own. For all through your life you may dream all alone. Once you have found her, never let her go. Once you have found her, never a bunch of broken hearts over there. (laughs) (laughs) If you would have spent a little more time putting these hearts up, they wouldn't have fallen. Yeah, that's the producer's job, I think. That's on you, Josh. (laughs) Josh. I don't even know if we had titles in here. I think he's he's now executive producer. This is not going well. need a woman in here to help us decorate, because we're terrible at this. Is that thing lit? Uh-oh. That would be awesome. Hearts on fire. That's okay. All right. We're doing so good now. All right. Lauren says, hey, Dad. Hey, Lauren. How you doing? Ron says, love the show tunes. Yeah, these are good. <laughs> the way you look tonight. Yes. All this, right. this was, uh, by the way, this was Mary and my uh, wedding song that we danced to. Oh, cool. So I'll throw this one out to you, Mary. Happy Valentine's Day. I love you. Someday when I'm awfully low, when the world is cold, I will feel a glow just thinking of you and the way you look tonight. But you're lovely with your smile so warm and your cheeks so soft. There is nothing for me but to love you and the way you look tonight. With each word. Tearing my fear apart And that laugh that wrinkles your nose Touches my foolish heart Lovely, never, never change Keep that breathless charm Won't you please arrange it? Cause I love you Just the way you look tonight Just the way you look tonight I've heard uh, I've heard worse in the restaurants and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and it was me. I thought that was it. <laughs> tonight. Uh, tonight. And ah. you have to go. Mm, <laughs> What'd you find another you one in here? Uh, that was it. Okay. Right. Right. I'll have to look. Let's <laughs> we'll see if we have, have any requests. Uh, ad Come on, lib, ad lib. We know you know some love songs out there. Um, oh, Lauren. you've had a couple of the, uh, oh, the yeah. Elvis ones. Let's do some Elvis songs. All right. He had some <laughs> love songs. I gotta find that on my phone, so give me just two shakes. What can't help doing? falling in love with you. Fools right. rush in. Okay, I can't okay. help falling in love with you. It's it's the same song. I don't know what it's called though. Three <laughs> titles. <laughs> this is Can't Help Falling in Love, is that right? If you are looking for inspiration for a love poem, you can look to Song of Solomon in the Bible. <laughs> Don't just, do that. Just, just be aware it's a little PG for those in our younger <laughs> yes. audience. So yeah. uh, <laughs> Your eyes are like the goats. Or oh, that's enough. All right. <laughs> All right. Cut the feet. <laughs> All right. Uh, here we go. Wise men say only fools rush in, but I can't help falling in love with you. 
shall I stay? Would it be a sin if I can't help falling in love with you? Like a river flows, surely. <laughs> <laughs> keep going, keep going. Uh, darling, so it goes. Some things are meant to be. Here we go, we got out of it. Woo! Take my hand. Take my whole life too. For I can't help falling in love. <laughs> we put something called the Disney ending on it, and he followed. I love that. Yeah, awesome. works every time. All right, how about that song where you spell a word? Uh, that's not Pete Cole, isn't it? <laughs> something like that. Uh, oh my goodness! I know you'll have some songs you want to hear. Any love song ever, any genre, Eddie can do it. Okay, that ain't it. <laughs> said, See how far you it's get. It's all in French. I can't do it. That's fine. Well, I don't know how to speak all that language. <laughs> That's fine. That, it's more of a romantic language. Yeah, I know. I can't do it there. What is it? What is that one? Love is... Uh... I think it's just a L space, O space. That's how you find it. All right. Working on it. Got a fill. Got a fill. Josh, tell a joke. Tell a love joke. I think this whole <laughs> show is a joke. <laughs> Josh oh, fell asleep over there. Josh, what's going on, huh? Come on, we need uh, some help here. Ah, there we go. Finally. Hell. Is for the way you look at me. Oh, is for the only one I see. V is very, very extraordinary. E is even more than anyone you adore. My bad, I messed you up. <laughs> I did the second ending. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> Or the way you look. Are we on the first or second now? I don't know. Where's the verse? You have to sing the verse. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, no. Do over. Sorry. Take two, live. Take two. Oh, where's our little clapper? We have a clapper over oh, there. Oh, we have Can a clapper? It? Yeah. I if think... we do that, it's like men in black. Nobody will remember. <laughs> no. They have a pen for that, not a clapper. <laughs> and it's a flash. It's a pen and a flash. <laughs> Can't you do the lights real quick or something? And flash. There we go. Ready? I have that kind of control. One, two, three. Take two. Hey, welcome, everybody. We're going to do Love by Nat King Cole. Uh, <laughs> maybe. L is for the way you look at me. O is for the only one I see. V is very extraordinary. I messed that one. Uh, is even uh, anyone that you adore and love is all that I can give to you love is more than just a game for two two in love can make it take my heart but please don't break it love 
was made for me and you. M is for the way you look at me. O is for the only one I see. V is very, very extraordinary. E is it? I can't do it now. Even though there's anyone yeah. can't love this all that I can. We will finish this song. To you. Love, love, love is more than just a game for two. Two in love can make it. Take my heart, but please don't break it. Because love was made for me and you. Our apologies to uh, to all Nat musicians who've ever lived. Nat King Cole, we're sorry for that one. We're dying on the vine Woo! here because no one's requesting any songs. No one's requesting any songs. <laughs> oh. Aaron, Aaron, uh, Aaron Brush, you know we know you have a song you want to hear. Uh, Mary, we know you have a song. Somebody help us. I assume Mary's still watching. I mean, why would she? I don't know. <laughs> Sherry, give us a song, y'all. What do you want to hear? Hmm. hmm. What's a good love song we could do? There's so many. <laughs> oh, how about, um, how's your 90s R&B? Uh, rusty. <laughs> More of an 80s person. <laughs> 80s love song. 80s love song. Oh, uh. <laughs> Wait, is that a love song? That's alone. Yeah, Till now, oh, it's got by on my own. Yeah, that's not a love. That's the opposite of a love song. <laughs> uh, Beauty and the Beast. Mary says. Dang on. Tale is old as you have to sing it like the um, cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> or what's the, the teapot? <laughs> no, the uh, the big armoire. What's her name? Oh, the teapot. Mrs. Potts sang this one in the original. Oh, did she? One. Yeah. Oh. All right, here we go. Ready? Here we go. Tale is old as time. True as it can be. Barely even friends. Then somebody bends unexpectedly. Just a little change <laughs> Small to say the least Both a little scared Neither one prepared Beauty and the beast Ever just the same Ever a surprise Ever as before and ever just as sure as the sun will rise. He goes up the wall one more there. And ever just the same. <laughs> ever a surprise. Ever as before. Ever just as sure. As the sun will rise, tale as old as time, tune as old as song, bittersweet and strange, finding you can change, learning you were wrong. What? Is that how it goes? <laughs> Certain as the sun, rising in the Tale as old as time, song is, what, uh, my lyrics are all jacked <laughs> no wonder I can't do that. Chorus, 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 here we go, here we go. Uh, and, I forgot what it was. And, and, and. Tale as old as time, this part. Yep, see the first verse again. True as it can be, barely even friends, then somebody bends 
unexpectedly. How does this song end? It doesn't end. <laughs> Where is it? Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> It's fun. more fun that way because I'm going off memory of playing that years ago. Yeah. Woo. Okay. Take three. Um, <laughs> I just called to say I love you. That's what Aaron All said. Right. Let's see. I... Thanks for the fan. <laughs> I just Stevie Wonder style. Uh, How's that? New Year's Day. You know that part? How, what's the first line? How's it go? New Year's Day to celebrate. Uh, we'll hear you in. Let's see. We can do it higher. No, no, no. No New Year's Day. Yeah. It's going to be high. Woo. To celebrate. No chocolate covered candy hearts to give away. No first of spring. No song to <laughs> sing. Good grief. In fact, it's just another ordinary day. No April rain. You kind of got to sing it like him. No flowers bloom. No wedding Saturday within the month of June. But what it is. <laughs> Made up of these three words that I must say to you. I just call to say I love you. I just call to say how much I care. I just call to say. I love you, and I mean it from the bottom of my heart. No summer's that's high. Good, that's good. Oh, is that it? Okay, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> that's pretty high up there. Uh, Aaron's Googling 1980s love songs. Uh, Can't help falling in love with you. We just did that one, Aaron, but give us a, another one, probably before you uh, started uh, watching. Jesus loves me. How could we not think of that? Oh, Jesus loves me. That is C. Uh, sounds good. This is more fun for me because I don't have to sing it. No. Ah, oh, not the right one. How does it go to that from that? You know? It's just not... <laughs> All right. Things are going well. We have to tell ourselves that. Yes. We tell ourselves that and then we come to reality. All right. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. Yeah. Man, that's the best kind of love, isn't it? That is. This earthly love comes and goes. I know. He loves us more than we can love ourselves. Man, how long did it take you to get past the honeymoon period, or are you still in it? I'm still um, in it. Good answer. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Uh, amazing love. Amazing, Amazing love. love. Is that in this Amazing book? Amazing love. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Good luck. Let's do it from memory. What's the verse? How's the verse go? <laughs> Amazing uh, hang on. Amazing let me love. see. I'm, I'm forgiven because uh, you are forsaken. Is it in C? Uh, I'm forgiven. That love. No, it's in F. Uh, yeah, let's try it there. All right. I'll follow you. I'm forgiven. Because you were forsaken, I'm accepted, you were condemned. I'm alive and well, your spirit is within me, 
because you died and rose again. I'm forgiven <laughs> because you were for sin. Oh, they did it twice, sorry. I'm accepted. You were condemned. I'm alive and well. Your spirit is within me because you died and rose again. Amazing love. Amazing love. How can it be that you, my King, should die for me? Amazing love, I know it's true, and it's my joy to honor you in all I do. I honor you. I'm forgiven because you were forsaken. I'm accepted, you were condemned. I'm alive and well, your spirit is within me because you died and rose again. Amazing love, how can it be that you, my King, should die for me? Amazing love, I know it's true. It's my joy to honor you in all I do. I honor you. Hey, do that chorus. I want to no see bridge. No bridge. It's just the same chord over and over. <laughs> do that chorus again. I'm going to try to put different chords to it. All right. Uh, how's it go? Amazing yeah, love. Okay. That part. One, two, ready. Amazing love, how can it be that you, my King, should die for me? Amazing love, I know it's true. It's my joy to honor you in all I do. I honor you in all I do. I honor you. <laughs> that's a good song, too. Yeah. yeah, that's the best kind of love. Yeah, it so really is. If you don't have a, a Valentine uh, this year, it's no big deal. We've all had several without one. So, um, yeah, but the, the strongest love of all is what, Eddie? The love that Jesus had for us, because it says in Scripture that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. And that's a that's a pretty kind of amazing love, just like we sang about, because uh, we're forgiven because of what He's done mm -hmm. and not because of what we've done. And, and that kind of puts it in perspective that uh, love is something more than just an emotion, and, and we'd be remiss if we didn't say that... Um, you know, Valentine's Day is filled with lots of emotion and gushiness and <laughs> and paper hearts and things like that. But but ultimately, you know, love is about commitment and love is about uh, the commitment uh, between a man and a woman as they express their love to one another. They're a reflection of what God did for us. And that's because it says, you know, for God so loved the world that he gave the world his only begotten son that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. And I think that's a pretty good message uh, of the gospel story in action and also the ultimate love that is, that is there. God made a commitment to us because he cared for us, because he desired a relationship with us. And uh, that really is the, the most perfect example. Of, whew, sorry. Uh, well, uh, it was perfect. Puberty change there. Uh, sorry. <laughs> the but, <laughs> but uh, you know, that, that is the perfect love that, that we sing about often here at Somerville Baptist, but also um, that, you know, we talk about when we want to be uh, loving, we want to love like Jesus did, and we want to love like uh, God loved us. So uh, that's the most important love that you can have. That's the most important love you can share. And uh, being committed to that that's other enough. person's well-being, I think, is uh, in, in our expression of that, looking out for the other person's interest more than your own, uh, I think is another example of just reflecting what God has done on our behalf. 
Yep. That's well said. Do you ever, and well, sometimes I have to pray after Eddie, and I'm like, what do I say? He said everything. <laughs> Just what Eddie said. God Amen. is good. God is good. <laughs> yeah. So we hope you find comfort in that, and you are enough, and that love is enough. It's more than enough. So, Absolutely. Um, do you know the song, I've Got You Under My Skin? I've got you under my skin. Yeah, am I going to have to come around again? Yep. We're going to end <laughs> on this one, Josh. And if we if it turns out bad, just roll the credits. We'll get out of here. <laughs> okay, you better start you better start rolling them now. <laughs> yeah. Um. So uh, a few things coming up. This um. Eddie, take it over. <laughs> this what Sunday? What are you talking? Uh, uh, what are we talking about? Um. If you haven't had a chance to listen to the Lawson Brothers podcast, it's on all the podcast <laughs> platforms, and it's hilarious. They're on episode four right now, so check it out. It's Sam and James Lawson talking about good stuff, so check it out. That's right. All right, here we and go. And don't forget, well, leader night coming yes. up this, yep. this Sunday. Uh, if you're one of the leaders in our church or consider yourself a leader or just want to come and see uh, what the leaders are doing, uh, it's okay. Uh, come uh, 5 o'clock. We're down at the, the worship center. Be a part of that uh, event. It's going to be a night of worship, a night of testimonies, and casting some vision for the future years. And I think it'd be an awesome thing to attend. Five o'clock here in the worship center at downtown campus. I've got you under my skin. I've got you deep in the heart of me. So deep in my heart, you're really a part of me. Wow. I've got you under my skin. I've tried so not to give in. I've said to myself, this affair will never go so well. Roll the credits. But why Get us out of here. I try to resist? We're trapped. <laughs> I've got you under my skin. I sacrifice anything. Come what might be the sake, sake of having you near. In spite of the warning voice that comes in the night. Take it, Brady. Repeats, repeats in my ear. Don't you know, little fool, you never can win. Use your mentality. Wake up to reality, but each time do, 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 I do, 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 just the thought of do, you do, do, makes do, me do, stop do, just before I begin. Do, do, Cause I've got do, you do, 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 under my skin. Do, 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 just do it out. Do it out. Do, 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 do. Have a great Monday. Glad you do have joined us, and that's it for us in Studio A in wonderful downtown Somerville. So long.